everyone, this is Yakarina here. In this video, we are going to evaluate the given integral. So let's get going. Evaluate integral sine square x into dx. We know that identity cos 2, 2 theta equals to 2 cos square theta minus 1 or 1 minus 2 sine square theta, right? So let's cancel this. Cos 2 theta equals to 1 minus 2 sine square theta. Now, bring this minus 2 squares, uh, minus 2 sine square theta to LHS. And take this cos 2 theta to RHS, you get 2 sine square theta equals to 1 minus cos 2 theta. Again, from this, you get sine square theta equals to 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 or 1 by 2 times 1 minus cos 2 theta, right? Since sine, sorry, sine square theta equals to 1 by 2 times 1 minus cos 2 theta. Now we can change the integrand. We will get for x, right? We will get 2x into dx. Now write the constant outside the integral. 1 by 2 integral. 1 minus cos 2x into dx. This is equals to 1 by 2 times integral 1 dx. That is integral dx minus integral cos 2x into, okay, into dx. Integral cos 2x into dx. Since we know that integral dx equals to x plus integral constant c and integral cos x dx equals to 1 by a sine x plus integral constant C. Then this becomes 1 by 2 times integral dx is x minus integral cos 2x dx is C compare cos ax. Cos 2x with cos ax then for a equals to 2 you will get 1 by 2 sin 2x plus integral constant C. So this completes a problem. So we have seen a problem from integration in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then. Bye bye.